Hello everybody, it is your favorite YouTuber live from your grandmother's basement and I am back at it with another video. With MLB The Show 22 just being a few months away and Christmas being tomorrow, I thought why not let it fly with a MLB The Show 22 wish list and some things that I'd like to see in the upcoming game. So let's get right into it. How amazing would it be if The Show 22 allowed us to put tattoos on our characters? Just think about it for a second. The mode is already pretty good, granted the lack of dialogue and cutscenes. Adding tattoos would bring so much more style and uniqueness to our ball player. The reason why I don't think it will happen is that San Diego Studios pretty much works for the MLB and they have to go by whatever the MLB wants and doesn't want in their video games. That's why you don't see fighting in the games anymore like we used to in some of the 2K MLB games. It's not really an important wish, but a wish nonetheless that I would like to see in the game. For the love of humanity, San Diego Studios, I'm begging you. I'm down on my knees like a little plump kid asking for a tasty Krispy Kreme donut. Please allow us to ask for a trade anytime we want. I feel like once we have been on a team for at least a year, we should be able to have that feature unlocked. I can't tell you guys enough how broken this system is. Not only are the cutscenes random when you're able to ask for a trade and you're waiting for your agent, sometimes it could take a whole season for it to happen. Oh, but there's more. Sometimes you don't even get traded and you have to wait almost a whole nother year for the cutscene to happen again. It's been broken for so many years. Please give us something different. Give us, I don't know, let us win the rookie of the year and then we're able to ask for a trade. Just give us something different. I'm begging you, I'm down on my knees. Come on. The biggest mistake they made in the show 21 was making Road to the Show an online game mode combining it with Diamond Dynasty. Not only were the servers bad the first month of the game cycle, but the core people who played Road to the Show were not having a good time. All because you guys wanted to allow people to be able to bring their ball player over to Diamond Dynasty and use them. Thus, not allowing our ball player to have 99 ratings in all categories. Why? because you wanted to keep the game balanced in favor of Diamond Dynasty players. This was the biggest mistake San Diego Studios has ever made in their game. When confronted with the problem with the combining of the modes, their reply was, you're not being forced to play Diamond Dynasty. Okay, yeah, cool. But you're taking control away from us being able to make our player have 99 stats in any category that we want. It would be so nice if the show 22 would allow us to influence what players our team trades for. In NBA 2K, when you've played a certain amount of games and you have maxed out your team's chemistry, the GM will allow you to request what player the team should trade for before the trade deadline is over. I think that would be nice for MLB The Show to do. Let's say you win Rookie of the Year and you have at least 10 bros on your team. Granted, everything is still the same. The GM should allow you to request the team trade for a certain player. That will probably cancel out the bad trading system that they have in the game and give players more reasons to stay on a bad team that drafted them instead of asking for a trade the moment they are presented with the cutscene with their agent. This is sort of a sleeper wish, but most people don't realize that most baseball players, even when healthy, never play a full season. I think that same rule should be added to the game as far as road to the show. We need a fatigue bar for every player like they have in franchise mode, 
where if we played 10 or 15 straight games, we had to miss one or two games in order to get our fatigue back up and we recover. That would just bring more realism to Road to the Show and people wouldn't have to worry about exhausting themselves playing all 162 games every season. Sometimes you get injured and you miss games here and there, but we don't want that to be the only way we miss games. All right, that is it for my wish list for MLB The Show 22. I thank you all for watching. Please leave your feedback down in the comment section and let me know your wish list and things you want to see in the upcoming game. As always, until next time, it's your favorite YouTuber live from your grandmother's basement, and I hope you guys all have a great day.